Hi, I'm Miley Proctor for LASparks.com at the Staples Center in Los Angeles where the Sparks are hosting the New York Liberty. But tonight's matchup isn't just an ordinary game, it's the 15th anniversary of the WNBA and a celebration of excellence in women's basketball. When these two teams met in 1997 for the inaugural WNBA game, the stage was set for the most talented female athletes in the world. Now, 15 years later, the WNBA has become the most competitive women's basketball league in the world and a coveted dream for young female athletes. Tonight's game will demonstrate the level of athleticism and talent the league has become known for and celebrate an important milestone in women's sports. Lisa, you've been a part of the league since its inception. We're standing right here on your court. What is it like being back here tonight? Well, it's really an amazing feeling. This is where we won our back-to-back -back championships in 2001 and 2002. Uh, this is truly what I do call home because I spent most of my adult years right here on this court trying to win every single time I stepped on the court. So um, I'm always happy, feeling good when I come back to watch the Sparks play. Tonight, specifically, the Sparks and the Liberty, it's a rematch that's 15 years in the making. So what is tonight about for you? It's all about revenge because we lost that doggone game. Um, even though it was a good day, we did lose uh, to the Liberty on the opening night, and I wasn't too happy about that. So hopefully the Sparks will revenge that win tonight. You got to go quickly no matter what you get. They don't get anything. Take it away by Quinn. That will do it. Noel Quinn's going to ride the timeout. And LA gets a hard fought win in a game that celebrates 15 years of play in this league. This is a big win for LA. They continue to be undefeated at home. You want to win on this on night like the, tonight. I mean, this is a 15-year celebration, and, and we wanted to celebrate it and not, you know, on a, on a losing note. So I thought that they did a good job, um, you know, like I said, especially down the stretch in the second half of fighting back and, um, you know, taking control of the game. So uh, it was a great win. It was a great win for, for, for us and, and, you know, hopefully for the fans tonight. It was pretty surreal, you know, when 15 years ago I was in high school, you know, so when the league first started, I was just a little baby trying to, you know, trying to get in the scene, you know, um, playing basketball at my high school. But it was an amazing feeling um, seeing Lisa Leslie do the, uh, the pregame announcement and even playing on the same team as some of these players that have been in the leagues for 15 years. It's just... You're just in awe. It's great. I mean, when we when we first started, everybody was a little skeptical. We didn't know if the WNBA was going to be here to stay. But 15 years after, I think it's stronger than ever. Very competitive, and to me, it's just a blessing to be a part of this league after 14 years. Um, to have you know to say that I play in the WNBA and the, that I play basketball as 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 my profession, as my job. So, um, just very blessed. It means a great deal because I, you know. I was 11 when the league started, but ever since I remember, there was a WNBA to aspire to play in. You know, um, I didn't have to shoot over, you know, the Michael Jordans and, um, you know, the Kobe Bryants. I could shoot over the Lisa Leslie's and, you know, Cynthia Coopers. So I had somebody to aspire to, to live up to and a team to aspire to play for and a league that I was confident would be there. And now it, that's our job to carry that forward so that we can be sitting here talking about the 30th anniversary. Not with me playing, I'll be on the sideline for okay. that. <laughs> it's special, you know, for me, um, you know, this time, you know, 15 years ago, I was nine years old. And so I was watching the game. I can remember watching the game in my living room. Um, and it's really special for me because, you know, I'm still playing with Tina Thompson, you know, the guys that were here. Um, from the beginning, so for me it's, it's special because I'm part of the past and part of the future. The 15th anniversary game is in the books. Here's to many more years of women's basketball. For LASparks.com, I'm Miley Proctor.